And we are back in Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Um, in the Lincolnshire story arc. So let's get to that now. We have a couple of different options. Um, in our last episode, we learned uh, that the elderman of this place, <clears throat> a guy by the name of Hundbert, or Hundbert, or I don't know how you pronounce it. I don't know how you pronounce anything in this damn game. And uh, that person has been dead, like, for a while. Uh, we found his corpse in the basement of a church, being kind of guarded by a lady, um, I don't know, a nurse or something, whatever she was. And um, there's been kind of a shadowy effort to keep his death a secret. And now that he has been discovered as dead, um... There's a, something of a scramble to replace him. So among the candidates to be... To, God, not really running for this position. The king is going to decide which of these people is named. Whatever. Uh, Elderman. Uh, are Hend Hundbert's son, by the name of Hunwald. Which is this thing here. So I can go talk to Acha, who's... I don't know, his friend or whatever religious advisor. So I can talk to Acha to find my way to Hunwald uh, and talk to him, or I can go talk to this fella here, Alfgar, who is another one of the dudes who is in the running to become the new Elderman here. Uh, so we're going to try this one, I guess. We're only over here because Hunwald asked us to escort him back. He had been, like, exiled by people who were friends of his father or something. I don't remember. Watch the last episode if you think you really actually give a crap. Um, and if you don't give a crap, keep following along. So, these guards reemerged, even though I killed both of them. They respawn, which is cool. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and climb over their heads. So, the lady I gotta talk to, Acha, she apparently called for last rites to for her for Hunvald's father, and it came out that she did so and therefore knew about his death um, way before anybody else did, and so we are suspicious of her. So that is a little bit of backstory before I talk to this lady. I don't know what she's doing hanging out so damn close to the guards. The guards tend to get itchy and try to attack me, Asha, basically, I tried to console him. immediately, so away. we'll see. I love the boy. Yeah, it's because you lied to him. But I fear what would happen if he took his father's title. He's fragile and scattered. I saw him ride north, following the paved Roman road, to the old tall tree where he often passed time with his father, I imagine. Hunwald loved you like family, and you lied to his face. In my way, I was trying to protect him. Saint Cuthbert, give me strength. Oaths and ale work better than your prayers and saints. Well, she feels guilty about it, at least. Okay. Um... So, we go and find and speak to this dude. <clears throat> but first, we kill these guys. Because they were annoying us by existing. Almost a thousand meters this way. Yo, pig! And, okay. So. Magical reindeer, time to go. If you hear crunching and slurping, it's because I'm eating pizza and having a drink. Something about an old paved Roman road or something? This is not paved at all. But you know what? Curse corruption lurks here. 
Yeah, I, I'm not, I don't want to do this side mission. I just want to get to the place in the map that I want to get to. I really, I don't care about your curses. Curses! What is that, like a squirrel or a ferret or a little thing running around? People don't notice me riding through their community on a star-speckled horse, a reindeer with moon glow on it, or whatever this is. Guess they didn't. Good. Like another one of those moon reindeer. No big deal. going on over here oh these woods i remember the days we spent here together here upon this spot ducking in the high <laughs> uh, hello uh, we're not going to talk Avon? just yet i'm going to steal all your Is things you? first uh yeah that's me but i got some looting to do couldn't help but notice there's stuff here that i can take all right got it okay Oh. Huh, okay. Hey, Vol, what Let's a talk, pleasant dude. surprise. Would you drink with me? Unwald? Uh, sure. Come, sit, sit. Stay with me a while and contemplate. Contemplate. Contemplate the view. Yeah, I know what you meant. Uh, if you're not careful, it's a poison you'll bear in your blood for the rest of your life. No need to worry. <clears throat> for I have found the antidote for it. Fair enough. Do not gorge on grief, nor give in to sadness. But let your aching love light the meat of your eyes and lead you to triumph. That is quite my father I'm quite a poet. You. He liked all those who could swing a sword and speak a verse with ease. He had a large heart and a love for his people. I think I would have liked him too. <laughs> he and I used to wander up this way all the time. He would take me hunting. And I would catch the m most wretched little things if I caught anything at all. I was a rubbish hunter. <laughs> but he always said he was proud. Each and every time. That seems like a good dude. To your father, Lord Hunbjorth of Lincolnshire. He may have dwindled from this world in death. But in life he was as stalwart as this tree. A white old oak. Yes. Skull. Skull. <laughs> and then, and then my father says... It's so we like to stay here all night drinking and talking about his dad? <laughs> oh, my Swanborough loves that one. She has a great sense of humor, my lady love. 
father would have liked her. Right. Your Dane lady love. She sounds lovely. Too lovely to be real. You know what? We should visit her. We should go to Brimsky. Oh, uh, gr Grimsby. Yes, yes, there's no time to lose. After you. Whoa, whoa. Really? We're gonna do this? We're gonna, like, drunk drive our like horses. like drinking and riding to jostle your troubles away. And the contents of your gut. Okey doke Now come. Well, let me guess. Bad guys are gonna attack us, because that's what they do. Shine. You Saxons and your tiny splendor. You have never seen mountains, have you? Or deep fjords like a giant's axe wound. Or towering falls that steam in the dead of winter. Snow sparkling like a blanket of jewels. That is splendor. Well, if your homeland is so splendor full, why come to England at all? You cannot grow Wait. crops on a blanket of jewels. Ha! Very oh. true. I'll admit, he does have your away with words. Sight does take the breath away. Quite so. Quite so. I love this land. And should I follow my father's footsteps, I shall do my solemn duty to protect her. I know many think me foolish and experienced, but I would ask it's that they my future hopes, not my past reputation. If I am given sway over this And what and is your past reputation exactly? Shame me. Do you me, deserve course. it? Because, like, that's the thing, right? I mean, if you have a reputation, it's probably because you did stuff to get the reputation. Just saying. Sometimes it's you. What was that? Birds able. It's my reputation's no fault for being your reputation. It's green. probably your fault for having the reputation. Did you do stuff? Oh, bandits. Stop here. Something isn't right. I'll find the trouble before it finds us. Uh, yeah, okay. People, I am sweating from pit to toe. Do not leave. Oh, shut up. Hush. Anyways, Stay we'll talk about your reputation issues. I assume I'm going to try to install you as the... I assume I'm going to try to install you as the... threat thing is done now. So I'm going to go ahead and assume it is not done. What do we got over here? We good? I killed everyone. We out. Killed three people. So more than three. Can anybody find me somebody to kill? Is that everyone? Is that everyone? That's odd. Is that everyone? He's telling me to eliminate the threat. I'm continuing to like kill these dudes. Some more dudes. Boop, 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 boop. And dead. Uh, 
and dead. We good? We're good now. No? Still no? Oh, dude down here. You are so done. Ugh. Now are we good? Oh, I should have thrown my weapon. Ooh, who would I have thrown it at? I didn't even see another person. Oh. Seriously? I could have thrown my weapon at that dude? Everyone. All right, kill everyone. Well struck, Eivor. Who are you? I'm just randomly standing here in the woods. Lucky I didn't kill you. Okay. And twice they tried to kill you, and twice failed. We had luck, but if you're not more careful, they will succeed. Someone in Mercia wants you dead, and they'll kill anyone in the way to see it done. Yes, including my dear Swanborough. My lady love. Oh, Jesus. Come, let yeah, us yeah, hurry okay. away. I am serious, Hunwald. Are you hearing me? Plain and clear. Follow me. Okay. Hunwald, are you sure this place is safe? The safest spot in the Shire, yes. Here I am with a chance to be Elderman, but I have yet to prove myself worthy. To you, to the Shire, to her. Uh, certainly to me. I mean, like, I don't know what your deal is with everyone else, but... What's... Yeah, what's this lady's name again? Alright, birds. This is a Hitchcock film. Get out of the friggin' way. Grimsby! Hey, everyone. Yes, she has some sort of quest for us. Uh, sort of homely. Well, Not gonna lie, dude. I thought for sure you'd be dead. Why didn't you send word? It has been far too long, my little jewel. I'm so very sorry for that. I'm fine, my love. I wilted without you, but still I grow. And who is this? Ah, yes. I am proud to present to And who Eivor the hell is the she? Raven clan. Hello, Eivor. A pleasure to meet you. Uh, and you, Swanborough. Yeah, sure. I wasn't sure what to make of Hunwald's stories. Yet here you are. Surprised to find that they... Not quite. I'm surprised to find a Saxon at yours. Hunwald seems to endear himself to all sorts. Eivor agreed to help me find my father. But I'm afraid it hasn't gone as well as I'd hoped. What's happened? My father uh, is well, dead. Well, we found him. Died of a cruel disease, apparently. Then shunted off to a cellar for burial. Oh, my love, I'm sorry. And someone in your shire wants to make sure Hunwald follows his father to the grave. Let them try. I'll cut their throats. A shire mood will see. I like this lady already, Hunwald actually. should stay here out of sight until he can attend. What if I left it all behind, my love? Forget my father's seat. What if I stayed here with you? Just the two of us. We can do it if we try. No. Just the, the two of us. must be led with courage and heart. Follow in your father's Honor, footsteps. Honor, courage, and commitment. The as he did. Whatever strength you lack, you have in Swanborough. Heed her advice. Yes. If anyone can lift my spirits in time for the shine, Yeah, I wasn't impressed with this lady to start with, but you know what? Come inside, eh, she's growing on me. Bumbling bones, love. 
Be well, Eivor, and thank you. She's sturdy. Keep watch right. over that one. Uh, I have come for him more than once. My blade will keep him safe. I do not doubt it. Yeah. Eivor is not a stranger to, like, snatching up other people's ladies. He's already hooked up with one elderman's wife and also his, uh, also her brother's wife, so. Notch this lady in my bedpost, too, here in video game land. Alright, uh, now what? Okay, speak to Alfgar. I guess that's, I guess that's what we do next, huh? Close are we to Alfgar? Not particularly. Let's take a look and see if there's any way we can fast travel and make this easy on ourselves. God dang it. Really? Why is everybody in the middle of nowhere? Alright, fair enough. What is this animal here? Usa? Ayusa? What is it? Seriously. What kind of animal is this? Alright. I might... I might fight this animal on my way out of town. Not gonna lie. We're gonna fight this animal. As long as it's not, like, too powerful for us. Which is entirely possible. Okay. Oh, animal. 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 There you are. Animal. Is it that? What is that thing moving? What is that? Alright, I want to get a better look at this thing. Well, what is it? is what it is I'm supposed to be hunting here. So these are legendary animals. When you see a paw print on the map, it's some sort of legendary animal. I'll sneak up on it, because animals are easy to sneak up on. Uh, animal. Ow. I didn't say you could do that. Pow! Skippity paps! Some sort of zebra thing? This is actually going super well. What are you, a hyena? I'm not even sure what it is I'm fighting here. It says Gmad Wolf, but it does not look like a wolf. It looks like it's got stripes and stuff. They're almost dead. I'm sorry, wolf. I'm not even sure why I'm killing you, other than the fact that you're on the map. Where did you go? Oh, I used up one of my special attacks. Oh, you've got friends. Skill points? The crooked, the cricket head wolf. I got its head. Awesome. 
Okay. Got it. That was great. Everything I ever wanted. Alright. Um, I do have some skill points to use. So let's do that. We're going to do some ability damage. Predator bow combo. Consecutive shots with a blah blah blah. Okay. Don't care. Sure. CX. I don't know what, I don't know what those things are. I'm not going to use it though. Whatever. I just probably wasted that. What do we got? I don't care. What do we got? Uh, interesting new pants. Don't care. can't really fast travel anywhere particularly close to where we're going. Would you get out of there, idiot? Um, so what we're going to do is we are going to find our way to the closest road and we are going to call our mighty steed and turn it on autopilot. Is this a road? Not really a road. There's a road. There's a road. map. We're going to remove that marker so as to not confuse our mighty steed. We're going to hop on our mighty steed. We're going to follow the road to our... And off we go! This is like uber... right now. Places to go, people to see, things to do. Someone help! They mean to hate nope. me for something I did not do! I, I couldn't care less. Gotta go, bye. I assume like a side mission, right? I think that's what we're doing here. It'll still be almost hanged, you know, in 70 hours of gameplay when I get around to like dealing with them again. to do. We're going to go talk to Alfgar. Doop. Doop. Doo doop boop boop be doop. Boobly boop. 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 Been expressing with my full capabilities, but they've been putting in correctional facilities. I don't like how I do this. I get straight and meditate like a Buddhist. All right, so let's find Alfgar. What up, Ava? Welcome to my estate, old friend. Thane Alfgar. Uh... It's an impressive amount of land you oversee. Quite right. I often get lost swimming to my island in this flowing sea of wheat. Um. You're flush with land and crops, to be sure. You're a brave man to flaunt your riches from this lonely hill. It's not bravery, it's trust. 
I trust the respect I've earned keeps Saxon and Dane alike from temptation. You said you had something to show me when we last spoke. What did you mean? Yes, I did. Observe. This fine specimen belonged to our beloved elderman, Hunbeort, before his untimely passing. The spiderweb? He left it here when we last hunted together. I now wish you to have it. That's nice of you. If this belonged to the Elderman, shouldn't it go to Hunwald next? I suppose so. But I thought you a more fitting recipient. You'd know how to use it. Now, now, take yeah. it and come hither. I have a rousing hunt plan for the two of us. Uh, I already have a bow. Thanks, so. Leave aside talk of politics and Shiremouths. Let us enjoy the fruits of my land together. We're hunting or fruit picking? Both, if you like. Whatever you fancy. I'm generous with the yields of my estate, as you will see. To be plain, A4, a great bear has been badgering my estate for weeks. I must do away with it. If only to prevent Oh, I am good at killing bears. You brought me here to hunt a bear. Yes, and I'm so pleased you agreed to come. I suspect you know better than most that I have what it takes to lead this shire. Though its line of kings is all but ended, the people of this land still teems with life, with promise. But today, the shire languishes. I mean, I don't dislike this guy. He's fine. Like me. I'm sorry? I'm the definition of new blood. It may be I should put my name in for Elderman. Ooh, that's a bold move, Eivor. Ah, there it is, that dark sense of humor. Blunt as a hammer, eh? Like the one carried by your, uh, uh your thunder god, uh, uh, I don't recall the name. Go on. Or what I mean to Mjolnir. say is, I enjoy the company of your people. Or people like you. What little I've seen of them. And I don't care what stuffy fools like Herofriv and Unwald say. You Danes are damn decent people. Well, Not dense at all. Hunwald is banging a Dane, so... I remember when the Danes first I think he's arrived. fine with them. Not long ago. The locals were terrified. Not of being raided, but of their spouses being seduced away. With all your perfumes and braiding and grooming and... and bathing, even. How novel. Bathing. <laughs> Craziness. Hunting, definitely. The bear's lair should be nearby. All right. You guys are doing your all weird bathing and crap ah, like that. Oh, hey, here's a like a Dane film. How wonderful to see you here. Oh, what fairy tales? Surprise. What surprise? I came as you requested. Uh, yes, and how is Grimsby? How are all the other Danes? I can't speak for all Danes, but I am well. And itching for a hunt as you made plain in your message this morning. Yes, that's right. Very good. Uh, speaking of Danes, I'd like to introduce you to Eivor. Uh, perhaps what you is know all of this craziness here? I don't care for this dude. It is good to meet you, Grim. Hey, Eivor. Did he lure you here as well with the promise of a hunt? He... Yes, yeah. hunting a bear. That's the point of all this. We're hunting. I promise. There's a cave what just up the hill there. Going on, dude. This guy is. If the beast is as large as Elf, some sort of lanes, operating. Take all three of us to bring it down. I'm game. Let's get a new fur cloak, shall we? Yeah. There's all manner of beasts in this forest. If we don't find the bear, we'll find something worth our supper. I like this grim fellow. Or I like him better than Elfgar. Elfgar is kind of a scumbag, but. Oh, this uh, grim fellow seems like he's my type of dude. Ooh, this what do we have here? This is the threshold of a beast's home. There's no doubting that. He ate a horse. He's so hungry he could eat a horse. Oh, hey, wolves. That's not a bear. Wolves. Uh, 
Everyone? Everywhere. And not a bear in sight. Oh, if I didn't know better, I'd say this dude lied to us about everything. Thank you. Take it. Regroup with Grim. Dude, if you got my boy Grim <coughs> hurt somehow. Boy, do I ever. Let's take a look. That smoke! Oh my god! My estate is burning like a twig! Soon to be a sea of fire. Eivor! You're skilled enough, and I can't tell you how to handle this, but please! My god, help me with this! I'm in this fight with you. A clutch of puny Mercians don't frighten me. Oh, Jesus. Okay, let's go fight these dudes. Alright. So, oh, yeah, I think you staged all this. I don't trust this friggin' dude as far as I can throw him. My people are playing. They must get to safety. Someone waited yeah, yeah. until you were away to set your world aflame. I'll send them straight to hell. The Marauders should be cautious around. I think he staged this. Hey, dude. This is gonna be some ass kicking. Really? I'm so tired of missing all of my attacks. And I hit somebody. Thank you. Oh, throw a weapon. Ah, dang it, I missed my chance. Hey guys! You can be dead, and so can you. Everyone? Dude, come on. I guess what? Alright. Hey, so you want to explain how you staged all of this? Lured us away to go Everyone talk to a bear when in fact did. there was no bear. Agreed. Okay, what do we do? Put water on him or something? What a mess. What do we actually? A sea of ashes. I thank you, Eivor, for doing what you could. You're a man of many riches, Algar. You can rebuild. To be sure. But I do not look forward to the toilet. <laughs> Sweet Lord in heaven! The bear is returned! What? The will start soon. I should return to Lincoln to see that it goes well. Can we attack the bear? I even got the bear for you, dude. Right? I mean... That is kind of funny, I won't lie. What's your thing here? Slashed and disemboweled by sharp weapons. Saxon blade from the look of it. I will avenge your death. First, by checking this one really slowly. Good, 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 good. Okay. Then, by checking this one really slowly. So apparently, this person actually like lost to this battle at some point. And by really slowly checking this one. Is that it? We good? Once I kill this? Once I check this one here? So it's a thing in this game where, like, other players who play it online or whatever. Feast. They, like, get killed in the game. And then I can avenge their death by killing the characters who killed them. Right? Like, that's my thing. I do them a solid. Your death has been avenged by Hrothgar's hammer. I have avenged you. Okay. Let's uh, fly ahead here.
way of the raven. It's the way of the raven. It's the feet of the fire. Okay, where the stone falls. Lay of Hunwald. The Shire Moot is set to begin. Votes will be cast for Hunwald, Alfgar, and Herfrith. But only one can be elected Elderman. Now, okay, to be clear, they don't elect the Elderman. What they do is they nominate an Elderman for the king to elect or you know, to appoint. So I just want to get our electoral system in, in 9th century England down. Okay, let's not overstate the importance of what this body has to say. And King Chaelworth, Chael, Chaelworth, Chaelwolf? Chaelwolf. King Chaelwolf is an ally of mine. I, you know, just want to say I may have installed him in power. Alright, so I don't trust this friggin' dude as far as I can throw him. Uh, okay. How far away is this I at least fast travel to this place? Oh, thank goodness. Fast travel it is. Save me some freaking time. Here I am, walking down the street. Hey, hey, I'm the monkey. Ain't got a monkey Go around. I'm too busy singing. Put anybody down. <laughs> We're just so happy to be killing. Okay. Talk to this lady? No. Hello? Exactly where do I have to be standing in order to speak? Is everything ready? The Shire Moot will soon begin. Will you join us, Eivor? We'd be comforted by your presence. Would you know? Yes, I'm uh, curious yeah, to sure. see this Shire Moot for myself. I will follow. When will the vote begin, Abbas? Twelve able lords of Lincolnshire have already cast their stones, but they have reached oh, wow. a tie. So it's almost Four done. For each man. It now wow. falls to you. Let me to guess. This impasse. Me. Why do I get the tie-breaking vote? You have earned the trust of our three candidates, it seems. Even our bishop has found a certain fondness for your hardy spirit. Oh, our bishop is kind of a dink. It's an important vote for your people. How would you counsel my vote? I value competent and righteous leadership, not foolish friends in high seats. Anyone but Hunwald, you mean. I love Hunwald as I love my own kin. But I would not put a stone in his care without fearing for the safety of both. I pray that God guides your vote today, and not the devil, as I fear. Oh. Ew. Not the devil, ah. Uh. Hmm. Okay, let's learn more. Let's see what these guys think. You, Lord? Have I heard aright that you have come to break us from our deadlock? I have, Lord. I, apparently. Have you any advice before I vote? Lord Hundbeor was a bold and honest man, if somewhat reckless. I see the same qualities in his son. Therefore, Hunwald is my man. Okay. Interesting. So the lady who knows him really well says not to go for him. Aye. The king sends his love and support. Whatever happens here today shall have his full blessing. He's learning fast. Good man. has got things to say. A vote for Hunwald will re Good there. evening, Elgar. Eivor, I hope it's not untoward of me to solicit your support, but I do need it. 
The vote is closer than a cat's whisker. It is a difficult choice, Alvgar. Know that I won't make it lightly. Good, good. But let me say, unreservedly, that I am the man who will lead Lincolnshire into progress and victory. I do not doubt your convictions, Lord. A vote for Hunwald will return the House of the Ferocious Swan to its former glory. Okay. Grim, good to see you again. A hearty hello, Drenger. Seems Britain is getting quite used to the idea of Danes stalking her shores. Where do you fall in this contest, Grim? Alfgar is a friend of yours, is he not? He is, and a good man as well. But I cast my stone for the bishop. The bishop? That's an odd strategy. These Christians are easy to nudge about. So desperate they are to avoid a good fight, they'll agree to most anything a Dane says. Okay. How fair you, Lord. My prayers are fervent and my will is strong, Eivor. If I am Elderman, I will bring joy to this Shire. There is more to good You're leadership incompetent. than merrymaking. You must be strong and stern and willing to take risks. Of course, of course. Strength. Yeah, yeah, sure, risk, sure. I'll do those things. All that. I shall rise above the peat moss of mediocrity. Have no fear. That is good to hear. Looks like I've got one more person. Out of the way, out of the way, out of the way. What's your deal? Bishop. Eivor, I must thank you for your fearless participation in our moot. I'm surprised to hear you yeah, vouch for Bishop. I surprised myself, to be honest. But I felt it would be a good test of God's faith in my judgment. Under my guidance, this Shire is crawling back from a decade of lawlessness. God knows the love that lives in my heart for the people of Lincolnshire. I pray now that he guides your hand accordingly. Quite a gambit, Bishop. Mad enough to work, it may be. Well then. I thank you for what it's worth. God go with you. <laughs> All right, let's pick. Free men, vicious swan. Possible futures. Oh. Which of these sad puppets will dance best when you call upon them? It is not for myself I must cast the stone, but for my clan. Who will serve us best in a time of true need? You can never be certain where you stand in another's heart. Choose only for yourself. Thanks, Oda. All three have strengths and weaknesses. Though tinged with arrogance, Alvgard is competent and wealthy. He'd be a good elderman, but a faithful ally? I want to talk about these guys Grunwald for a second. Grunwald is not the most cunning or clever, but he has heart and spirit. Both go a long way in times of need. The bishop can be stuffy wallows in Christian piety but he is wisest of the free and has already proven himself uh, Elfgar though tinged with arrogance Elfgar is competent and wealthy but a faithful ally Oh, he will be. I choose Alvgar. Alvgar is. He's sturdy and competent, and his wealth will be a boon. I have chosen. It 
It is decided. By the grace of God, the new Elderman is Lord Algar of Lincoln. Sorry. God has spoken, and his voice is a clarion call. As your Elderman, I will work to better this Shire, to foster peace between its people, and to serve our king. I bless you all. Let us all raise our cups. A toast to our new Elderman. Hey. As all well know, this Shire Moot's decision is not final, but advisory. It now falls to our newly anointed King Cheowulf to ratify our choice. To this end, we need not worry. Cheowulf is a friend to Saxon and Dane alike, and he is sure to approve the results. Our good and noble friend, Arvelswith. A septic rot has overtaken this shire. A sickness for which there is only one cure. Your grace! Is there, like, kill the this? person that I just... Bro, oh, ew! Nobles of Lincolnshire, stand fast! For the glory of the Oh, ancients. there is some ass-kicking about to happen now. Oh, wow. Vicious. Steal yourself. That guy. Okay. I hate it when he does that. Is this how their guard welcomes Something a new Alright, enough. Enough of your crap. Wait, would you not? Pay for your things! Have another dude. Did he explode? Your troubles begin early, Elgar. We'll find and kill that man. Yeah, that sounds like a good plan. Such carnage could happen in Lincoln. Well, your bishop is kind of a dank. The grief tosser can't break to you, bud. Far. Raise a fear and march against what many of Grief tosser. Agreed. Hunwald, will you fight with me? I will. Do it, dude. Come on. For the sake of Lincolnshire, I bloody will. Thank you. Good dude. Let's smoke that bishop. Kind of over this face paint deal that she's got here. I think when I get done with this mission, I'm going to go change her tattoos. at a loss for words. A trusted man of the cloth. <laughs> I didn't trust him. I will pray for these martyrs and tend to the remaining wounded until the last man walks free. Okay. Be well, Archer. And you, Eivor. May God or, or the gods protect you. So if this nun thing doesn't work out for you. 
Uh, trying to nail anyone. All right, so what's your deal? So many innocents cut down. Herefriz, the fog rat, the shit eater. The devil has him, that's plain to see. Bloody murder! Oh, oh, am I supposed to talk to this person? I don't know. What Speak remains? to the new elderman. The sword, a sword shower in Annicaster. Where is the dude at? He's over here somewhere. To the new elderman. All right, so I don't know that I want to. I feel like I've done enough here. I feel like the next thing that happens is probably going to be complicated and take a long time. So, I've been streaming this for about an hour. I think that's a reasonable amount of time for an episode here. Ooh, he's clutching their pearls. Uh, uh, Who? Give it a pass. Okay, so yeah, as I was saying, uh, we're going to get close to the end of Lincolnshire here. Bow! Skippity-paps. Um, okay, where were we? Uh, we're going to speak to the Elderman. The Elderman, the Elderman. Oh. Felt by treachery. Sharp edge. Well placed cuts. Looks like a Saxon blade of some kind. Looks like these idiots actually killed somebody. Getting a little bit of XP here. Since I fairly easily killed these dudes. You've been and my Ghostly Wanderer, I got your back. Alright, so I'm gonna apply my skill points. That's an exciting thing you watch me do. See. Okay. So, quests. Bishop Herefrith has fled to here and holed up in a fortress with his most loyal guards. Eivor sets out to confront him with some help from friends. Okay, so this is going to be a siege. This is going to be a siege. Sieges are time-consuming quasi-pains in the asses. Do I want to do a siege right now? Okay. That's a good question. Okay, so we know who this dude is. The Crozier. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Once we kill him... We will know who the liar is, right? Right? He's the last dude. He's, we'll know who he is. 
God, do I want to do this? I don't know if I want to do this. I really don't. All right, I'm going to end it here. I think I'm going to end it here. Um, my next episode will begin with the exciting siege of uh, this guy's castle. Stay tuned next time for the exciting siege. Yeah, this elf guard, I don't entirely trust this elf guard dude, but like, he seems like legit. He's like, he's a rich old white guy. I mean like, who else should be in charge other than rich old white people, am I right? So, um, there's a donkey that's like just doing work on its own without like a person anywhere nearby. The donkey's like, screw it, I'm on break. Just like died or whatever. I'm a little concerned about this donkey right now. Did this donkey just like die? Oh, no, no, you're good, you're good, you're good. No, 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 just, just taking a little break. Just taking a little break. Just taking a little break. I'm worried about you, man. Where's your person? Why are you just carrying heavy things around? He's like, this is, man, like, I'm just carrying heavy things around everywhere. There's no people. I'm just doing all this work myself. I own this farm, I'm a donkey. Uh, I do everything here. I don't even have hands. A couple of pecker heads, I think. Okay, well. You had a nice time, donkey. Okay. Until next time. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye.